Let's have a look at the BIOS setup here on Lenovo Legion Go. First of all, enter BIOS setup, turn off your device, press power button and press and hold the volume up li like this. You will have this display here, select BIOS setup. You will have um, the main screen with some info related to to BIOS version and your CPU and GPU and after that press here more settings and go here to configuration well you will have the system time let me lock the camera here for the display you will have um, the system time here available let me take a pen let's see if this one works yes um, after that um, you, you have the date, you have the possibility to enable or disable the wireless on this device, storage controller mode, mode. it's only one option um, here. Um, you can change um, uh, 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 frame buffer size, this is basically um, the VRAM available for your device. In this way, um, you can uh, you can select it from BIOS directly from here. Three gigabytes, four, six, or eight, or automatic. I will advise you to play in general with six gigabytes. This fe this feature don't uh, don't change it. BIOS flashback also don't change this one. Disable built-in battery. Also, um, don't uh, don't mess with uh, with this one. It's for service mode to disable the battery. Um, thermal mode. How the device to work with that GPU and watts or wattage. You have the possibility to to work with custom quite performance or balance. I prefer to have the device when it starts to have the performance mode. Um, one key battery, when powered off, connecting the adapter will show battery information. This is really interesting because when you connect uh, the charger, if you, um, if you have the device off, you will see on the screen uh, the percentage of your battery so I will advise you to enable uh, this one also don't uh, don't mess with be yourself uh, healing let it uh, enabled uh, this one is very important charging speed selection under high loading I decided to to work with fast because whenever you play a game uh, and let's say you you reach the battery at 15 uh, percentage 40 or 60 or whatever you want the battery to be charged fast it's up to you i decided to go with fast you can go with medium or slow i believe with slow you will see the battery if you play you have 80 percent battery it will stay there probably something like that so my advice go with fast charging during uh, gameplay increase external compatibility i believe there is no need to enable or disable this one at this point my advice don't don't change this one the thermal policy um this is a bit advanced and from what i um, what i did my research some people when uh, when they change to stamp they will suffer some downgrade in performance whenever the temperature will reach high uh, uh, degrees it seems that it's a problem if you if you choose stamp this one the second one so i i believe the best way to play it with this one the first one here maximum memory data clock speed my advice select 7500 this is uh, this is the speed for a ram enable uh, cpu core number so here we have 8 
and also make sure that you have enabled multi-threading mode this will really help in games and in everything so here it is related uh, to to security here it's up to you if you want to select um, a password or not for uh, for um, administrator it's really up to you also uh, here usb boot make sure that you have these ones um, enabled and basically this is it after that press um, save changes or exit saving changes and you'll save you'll save your uh, modifications so uh, this is it here exit saving changes press yes and this is it